Cause the neighbors think I'm selling dope, selling dope. Okay, the neighbors think I'm selling dope, selling dope. Hey guys, what's up? It is Mass here, and welcome to the Paul Millsap Denver Nuggets rebuild. Now, Paul Millsap and Nikola Jokic, let me just say, that front court is dirty. Anyway, Jameer Nelson's really a starting point guard. What happened to Moutier? Hello? Moutier, hello? He's a 72? Oh my goodness, I did not know that. But, before we get into anything, I just want to talk to you guys for a second. So, as you know, if you saw the update video, if not, I recommend you go check it out. It's from last Friday. I said I'm on vacation, so these videos are being pumped out. You know, my schedule is usually Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and then streams in between, but I haven't been streaming this week because obviously I'm on vacation and stuff like that. But anyway, like I was going to say, if there's any way you guys want me to make these videos better, like instead of me simulating the full season talking to you guys, I could cut the season out like I used to do in my old videos when I first started and stuff like that before the videos did well and stuff like that. I could do that, and I could take it another season if you want see how the NBA shapes up. Tell me anything you want in the comments, like cut the season out or go another season or something like that and try and go for like a three-peat or something if my team's good or anything like that. Just anything, tell me in the comments. One final thing, if you guys haven't seen the Gordon Hayward Celtics rebuild, go check it out. It's the video before this. Anyway, let's get right on into this. First matter of things, I want to trade for a better point guard, so that's going to happen. Let's see if we can trade Jameer Nelson and Kenneth Fareed. Let's see what we can get for them, too. Sorry about that. I had to take a drink. I mean, you guys really have been enjoying these videos recently. Uh, let's see. Let's see. A point guard, a point guard, a point guard. We could sign Ty Lawson back in free agency if we really wanted to. Okay, we got absolutely no help from that. Thank you so much, 2K. I appreciate it so much. Alright. Bye. Malik Beasley, I'm sorry. Trey Lyles on this team? I forgot about that. Oh, my. Alright. Let's sign Rudy Gay to a one-year deal. Bring him to the team. Uh, sign Ty Lawson to a deal. Bring him to the team. Bring him back to the team, actually. Alright, so, Wilson Chandler, alright, the bench isn't looking terrible, I kind of want to trade some guys on the bench, like, Jameer Nelson, I don't, I don't really know, 35 years old, I don't know if he's in the future of this team, Juan Herma Gomez, let's see what we can get for him and Jameer Nelson, Jody Meeks, GOAT, Steven Adams, not bad, but we got Jokic, so, ooh, Norman Powell, that isn't terrible, but we have enough shooting guards on the team, so that's it's okay. Dude, literally, excuse me, nothing. I actually kind of like this. Where is it? I passed it. I kind of like this. I'm actually going to take this trade because it's an, uh, definitely an upgrade to the team. Pat Beverly and Montrose Harrell, welcome to the team. So, Nuggets fans, are you guys hyped that you got Paul Millsap? That's a nice free agency signing. I really didn't expect him to go there, but, I mean, it surprised me a little bit. We could definitely trade Darrell Arthur and Montrose Harrell. Let's see. Darrell Arthur and Montrose Harrell right next to each other. Cool. So, Nuggets fans, you guys are in the tough Western Conference. Now, obviously, you guys know that and stuff like that. But, I think you guys will do all right. You guys can sneak into the playoffs maybe... Eight or seven seed, depending on how you guys do. Dude, I really don't know what to get here. Like, I really couldn't tell you. I might just... No, nah, I really don't care. Alright, you know what? We'll just keep them on team, whatever. So, we're going to simulate through the season. The Western Conference did definitely get tougher. No doubt at all. Why are we losing games? I don't know. But, Nuggets fans, you guys got a nice future. Definitely. Jokic is a beast. Him and Paul Millsap are going to tear it up. I think Moutier is going to pan out soon. And you guys got, like, Will Barton and Gary Harris, really good guards. So, I think you guys will be all right, definitely. But it's just the West is really, really tough. Just look, 10-7, and 7, we're fifth. 
That's crazy. In the East, that's maybe like, nah, probably like a four seed, to be honest. The West just really is very tough. But like I said, you guys are going to have a great future and stuff like that. There's a lot of teams with great futures in the NBA. And Denver, Denver's a good place. Uh, personally, not a fan of your jerseys that much, but that's just me. Anyway, we can... Sorry, I was looking at something. We can just simulate through the season. Like I said, guys, in the beginning of the video, if you guys want me to cut the season out and stuff like that, just tell me in the comments. Tell me if you want me to take another season and stuff like that. I'm always open to you guys telling me what to do. Like, what, what would make you tune into the video more? Like, what would help you watch my videos more and stuff like that? And I know I do have a nice little uh, fan base going around. Sorry, I was looking at something. I have to make someone uh, Twitter Abby in a minute. But that's just something that I don't have to worry about right now. That doesn't. All right, anyway. So I, I completely lost my train of thought, to be honest. Just tell me in the comments what would help you. What would make you want to watch my videos more? Like, what would help the videos out and make them do better that you guys would tune in more and more people would tune in? Just tell me something like that in the comments. And tell me in the comments, like I always do this every video, predict your team's record in the comments below. I predict the Sixers 47 and 35, I think it was. I think that's what I said. Good enough for fourth in the East. Fourth or fifth, I don't know. Milwaukee could be ahead of us. Anyway, like I said, predict your team's uh, record in the comments. If you're a Nuggets fan, say what's up in the comments. I know Nuggets fans are watching this. All NBA fans are watching this probably. Probably thinking this kid has no idea what the hell he's doing. But hey, that's your guys' opinion. I respect it. I don't make money off this, so who cares? It's just something I do for fun. You know, just try and uh, have fun with it. And that's what I try and do, produce these videos for you guys. Anyway, the season's almost over. 52 wins on the season for the Denver Nuggets. Well, now we got 54, 55. 56. All right, let's go. 58 and 24 to end the season. Not bad. Russ wins MVP for the second consecutive year. Lonzo wins Rookie of the Year. Shaping up just like last video. Jeremy Lin wins six man. Sam Whiteside, defensive player. Nikola Jokic, most improved. And Billy Donovan, coach of the Thunder, 61 and 21, coach of the year. That was the only difference from the last video's awards. Uh, all NBA teams. Anyone from the Nuggets. No, look at this. Oh, that's it. No wonder. Okay. There's Nikola Jokic. Okay, I like that. No one here. I just started pouring. All NBA teams. All right. Let's take a look at the season stats for our team. Jokic led team with 18 points. Paul Millsap with 16. Wilson Chandler with about 14 Rudy Gay with about 13, Gary Harris with 12, Will Barton with about 10, almost 10, Kenneth Free with about 9, Pat Bev with 8, Ty Lawson with about 7. Not bad. Moody A, nothing. All right, whatever. We got the... Can't see, can't see. We got the San Antonio Spurs up first, the 6th seed. We're going to get knocked out first round, aren't we? How are the Spurs a 6th seed? Hello? Okay, we tied it up. We take the lead. Let's go. Oh, but now we got the Warriors. Nice. That's a rip. If you're this far into the video and you see this right now, give me a rip in the chat. Oh, in the comments. Come on. Oh, that's a rip. That's a rip. How was that the fine? How? I don't understand. Guys, I don't understand, but that's it for me. If you guys did enjoy, leave a like, subscribe, comment down below. I'm out of here. I'll catch you guys all later. Peace.